Hey guys, IoT Geek is here to demonstrate a cool IoT based project MT7687 Enchanted Light. As per many surveys, in 2020 there will be 20 billion IoT based connected products will be there in the market. Yes, you have heard it right, 20 billion and the population of world is only 7 billion. So in the future, we all will be surrounded by number of IoT devices around us. Just imagine that you need to configure and collect data from all these IoT devices using the mobile application. How annoying it is. And your cell phone will be populated with lots of applications dedicated to each device. It is very annoying to communicate with all these devices using words and language and graphs and data that we use right now. So to solve this problem, we have uh, put a small step with this project to make the communication between IoT devices and the user very intuitively without using a single word or a graph or data. So let's see how this project MT7687 Enchanted Light will work. This is a chest strap which I have designed and it will measure the vital body parameters and also send this information to the cloud via MQTT. Recently, this chest strap is communicating with my Android application installed on my mobile phone to show me all this data. In this demonstration, this chest strap is just used as a probe to demonstrate the functionality of Enchanted Light. If you want to know more about this uh, smart health monitor chest strap, then look at the link below. Right now, this enchanted light is going to tap the data which is make communication between smart health monitor and my mobile phone. So just by looking at the color of light in this heart and this thermometer, I can visualize that my heart rate is above the certain threshold or below the th certain threshold and the body temperature in similar way. The threshold value is going to be set by this mobile application. So in this demonstration of enchanted light, I am using MQTT FX to send the MQTT packet to enchanted light. Here MQTT FX will going to simulate my chest strap. Here as you can see, a heart rate and body temperature is in normal range. So both lights are green. Now. Now let me send a MQTT packet which will represent a low heart rate. So when I send the packet, as the heart rate is low, a heart symbol will become blue. Now let me send a high heart rate. So when I send the information regarding high heart rate, the heart will become red. Now I am going to send a low temperature indication. So a thermometer will become blue. And when I send a high body temperature information, a thermometer will become red. Now I am going to send chest strap is not wet information. So both LEDs should become white. So let me send it. So as you can see both LEDs are white means chest strap is not wet. Now when you wear the chest strap once again the information is sent like this and it will become red because heart rate and body temperature both are above threshold. Now let's say the heart rate is become normal so heart rate will become green. I have used free altos MQTT client and smart connect library of MT7687 for my project. When the system is getting powered up, if this push button is pressed, the module is going to enter in smart connect mode and using the alien application on Android phone, SSID and password of the access point which the module is going to be connected in future can be stored inside the 7687. Earlier, I want to design this enchanted light to get work with this Withings activity monitor and heart rate monitor. But this Withings heart rate monitor and activity monitor is not real time sync with the mobile application. I have used my own project 
Smart Health Monitor to demonstrate this project. 